Now that we've talked a little bit about logarithms, let's go ahead and talk about two very special and important type of logarithms. So we're going to talk about the common logarithm. We'll talk about this one first. So this is the logarithm that has base 10. So if we have log base 10 of, let's just say x, or really anything, but for this discussion we'll just use x. So if we have base 10 log of x, then we can write that in a shorter way and just say log of x. So if you ever see this written, then this is just a short way of writing log 10 of x. And really, uh, you could still use this if you want, it's still correct, but most people just use this, and it's understood that this means the base 10 log of x. Okay, so that's one special type of log, and then another one is called the natural logarithm. And that is the logarithm base e of x. Now what's e? So e is the special number. e is approximately equal to 2.71828182828. Now it looks like this number is about to repeat infinitely, but it actually does not repeat infinitely. Um, from here it breaks off into 4, 5, 9, 0, 4, five dot 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 so this just keeps going on forever and it never repeats uh, this number e is an irrational number so that's why it goes on forever and doesn't repeat um, and this number of digits here this is way more than you'll ever really need for any practical application but I just wanted to point out um, that it even though it looks like it's going to repeat at first it really doesn't and this number e here has a pretty rich history um, there's a lot of interesting stuff going on behind it um, several books have, or entire books, have been written about this number, this number alone. So uh, I encourage you to check some of those out if you're more curious about this number and where it comes from. Uh, it shows up in a lot of different branches of mathematics and science in general. Uh, pretty crazy stuff. But anyway, it's uh, especially important in logarithms. So if we have the base e log of x, that's the natural logarithm. And the way we abbreviate that is ln x. So that's a lowercase l, lowercase n, and then x. So if you ever see this written, uh, that's a short way of just saying base e log of x. Now, you could say this, and that will be correct, but people might look at you funny, because nobody ever really writes this. But again, it is correct. Um, but the more, uh, I guess, the more natural way to do that, sorry, bad joke, uh, would just be to use this. Uh, now, I do want to point out, though, that this is not correct. Okay, So this is uh, very bad. We don't want to do that. People will still know what you mean, but it's not correct, so we don't want to do that. So you don't want to put the base e here because the ln already means you have a base of e. That's uh, already implied. Okay, So that's an introduction to the common logarithm and the natural logarithm. So common log base 10, natural log base e.